Well, our top story, a standoff between India's Central Bureau of Investigation and the West Bengal Police is unfolding in Kolkata at this moment. Well, the police has detained five CBI officers outside the residence of the Kolkata Pol Police Commissioner Rajiv Kumar. The CBI team was there to question Rajiv Kumar in connection with the Sharda scam and the Rice Valley Chit Fund scams. However, in a dramatic turn of events, the CBI team have, has been taken into custody instead. A police team has also reached the CBI Joint Director's house in Kolkata. West Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee has arrived at the police commissioner's residence as well. Banerjee has extended support to Rajiv Kumar and accused the central government of carrying out a political vendetta. Kartike Sharma, our political editor, is now joining us live on the phone line. And Kartike, well, uh, interesting things unfolding there in West Bengal. The CBI team goes to, uh, to question the police uh, commissioner. They instead themselves get detained by uh, the police of Kolkata. And time and again, of course, the issue of the CBI being used by the central government comes into play as far as other opposition parties are concerned. And for, uh, for the central government, of course, the issue of corruption rises every time. Absolutely. See, there are three fundamental issues for, uh, for our viewers here. One is that India has a strong structure, which means that India has a strong central government, but over a period of time, economically, it's very, very All this is the remit of this. Second is the functionality between the, uh, the police of Kolkata, which is the West Bengal Police Cadre, and the Central Bureau of Investigation, which is formed by the All India Police Officers, they have their own deputation. And the foremost is the generic fight between the central government and various other institutions uh, which are functioning with our politics, for example, Reserve Bank of India, Judiciary, Central Bureau of Investigation, uh, or the uh, Indian Statistical Organization, uh, of which the two independent directors put in their papers because the job data was not being released on time. So it brings me to the first issue that both the parties can come out with narrow technical means to defend their position. But the fact is that it somehow tells you that the federal arrangement or the, uh, the dharma of the federal arrangement has been violated. And nowhere, um, you know, the federal uh, authorities and state authorities have ever fought like that. It has never become state versus center or West Bengal versus New Delhi. Secondly, somehow it shows ineptness on part of the, the central government also. You know, this, has, this shows that this is being done without keeping the chief minister in loop. And secondly, it has allowed politics to play its part. And thirdly, in the foremost... I think it does great damage to the way state and the central function, uh, institutions function. Now, if this is the way it will function right before the Lok Sabha elections, uh, the, the die is cast that it's going to be very, very vitiated election, one. Secondly, a lot of people will lose faith in Central Bureau of Investigation. Its image has been tarnished. Two of the senior most officers have were taken out of the Bureau in a midnight drama which took place, and the CBI right. was locked out. So I think citizens need to really take this very, very seriously. It is like FBI going to some state and the FBI officers themselves get locked up in a Michigan uh, state police station because right. somehow FBI did not keep the dispensation in loop. Right, uh, Kartik, and of course we are now seeing visuals uh, from Kolkata that are live. We are presuming that there will also be a press conference at some point. Uh, who's going to be holding that press conference? We're not sure at the moment, but it could very well be, uh, well, Mamta Banerjee as well, who has lent support uh, to the police commissioner, has also arrived, we believe, at uh, the police commissioner's residence. This is, of course, playing out uh, as a CBI versus the state police saga as we speak uh, uh, on corruption charges now. Uh, remember, this is a CBI team that had gone to question the state police commissioner and instead got detained at a local police station. So, uh, interesting times ahead, as Karthike was pointing out, ahead of the general elections.